From the strange and unexplained to the things that go bump in the night, this program has been created to help you survive against the very real threats in this world. These are the Creature Files. <coughs> Creature File number 10, Trolls. Trolls are a unique humanoid species that are hard to pin down as they come in a variety of shapes and sizes. They can be found all over the world and trolls from different parts of the world usually have different features and strengths based on their environment. Like forest trolls, which are usually more brown and green, versus mountain trolls like the ones native to Norway that are usually a pale gray. All trolls have a hunched posture with large facial features. Oftentimes, they have long hooked noses and long, sometimes pointed ears, and many trolls also have long tusks. Trolls in every group come in two main body sizes, a thin lanky troll, which often travel together, and the large hulking forms that roam alone in a larger territory. Trolls don't usually gather in large numbers. They either live alone or in a small family group of around four or five. They're usually harmless, but if a troll wanders near a human town, there can be some issues, especially if a troll is desperate. Opportunistic trolls will often try to take children in the night, and they do this by either luring a child into the woods or entering a home themselves and casting some kind of enchantment. Trolls have a curious ability to cast charms and curses. It's believed that this is how they're able to remain hidden even when they're living amongst humans, sometimes only showing themselves to individuals, usually in a shaded area like under a bridge. This leads us to a troll's major weaknesses, and arguably the one thing that keeps their threat level low. During the day, a troll is completely turned to stone. This is why many trolls opt to live in caves or in dense forests. Curiously, milk also seems to be an effective way to keep trolls at bay. More study is needed to understand why. Otherwise, trolls are quite resilient and strong, and while they can't instantly heal wounds like vampires or werewolves, they can actually regrow entire limbs, though this process does take a few weeks. This concludes creature file number 10, Trolls. Tune in throughout the week and the rest of this month for more survival tips and creature portfolios. And as always, stay safe out there. <laughs>